Okay, so I'll tell a story. You go around and grab Emma, just like we rehearsed. <laughs> yeah. I brought marshmallows! Yay! Yay! Everyone take one and pass them around. I can't get the fire to light. Here, let me try. I saw this on YouTube. I guess we'll have to do scary stories with that fire then. Who's going first? I will. On a time in a deep dark woods just like this one there was a big big monster who go behind their victims and drag them back into the forest <laughs> When shall we meet again? In thunder, lightning, or in rain? When the hurly burly's done, when the battle's lost and won. That would be air, the set is set. Where the place? Upon the heath there to meet with. <laughs> <laughs> I come, Grey Malkin, Paddock calls. Anon. Fair is foul and foul is fair. Hover through the fog and fill the air. Where, Where has thou been, been, sister? Killing swine. Is anybody else cold or is it just me? Sisters, hand in hand, pastors of the sea and land. Thus to go about, about, thrice a thousand, thrice to mine, and thrice again to make up nine. Peace! The charms wound up. Look, everybody, look, the moon, the moon, a new moon, like a silver bow, new bent in heaven. Look. Mustard seed, cobweb, moth, lemon, 
Mustard seed? I haven't it's seen them in for months. Ooh. Not properly. Not with the weather, like it was, like it's been. The rain, such rain. But the moon, clear skies. That's a good sign. Things getting back to normal. Look, everyone, it's a... Something important. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're seeing this, we've gone missing. Why? Because Indiana Jones over here decided it would be a great idea to drag us into an abandoned building instead of watching Strictly. Can you give that back? Give it back. The air bites shrewdly, it's very cold. It's a nipping and an eager air. It's Baltic. We could be watching Strictly. Giovanni was wearing such a tight... What's now? Uh, I think it lacks 12. Oh, oh yeah. No, no, it is struck. Indeed, I heard it not. Oh, well then, it draws near the season wherein the spirit held its want to walk. Look, everyone, it comes! Angels and ministers of grace defend us. Be thou a spirit of health, or goblin damned, bring with thee airs from heaven or blast from hell. Be thy intent wicked or charitable? There comes in such a questionable shape, I will speak to thee. I'll call thee Hamlet. Cousin? Friend? Royal Dane, oh, answer me. Let me not burst in ignorance, but tell why thy canonized bones, hearsed in death, have burst their sermons. Why the sepulchre wherein we saw thee quietly in earned hath opened its ponderous and marble jaws to cast thee up again with thoughts beyond the reaches of our souls? Say, why is this? Wherefore? What do we do? Oh, I beckon you to go away with it. Look, with what courteous action it draws you to more move ground, but do not go with it. No, by no means. It waves me forth again, I'll follow it. Do not be a fool who knows what it's capable of. What if it take me toward the flood or to the dreadful summits of the cliffs that beetles o'er its base into the sea and they resume some other horrible form and draw you into madness? Mark me. <gasps> the time has come when I, too selfless and tormenting planes, must render up myself. I am thy cousin spirit, doomed for a certain term to walk the night. Methinks I sent the morning air. Brief let me be. Let me tell you of my murdered tale. Sleeping within my orchard, my custom always of the afternoon. Upon my secure hour thy uncle stole, with juice of cursed heaven in, in a vial, and in the porches of my ears did pour. The leprous distillment, whose effect holds such enmity with blood of man. That swift as quicksilver, it courses through the natural gates and alleys of the body, so did it mine. The glowworm shows the matin to be near, and gins to pale his uneffectual fire. Adieu, 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 remember me. Heaven will direct it. I knew we should have watched Strictly. Oh, fight. Hold, hold my heart and thou perfect ghost. So. Uncle, there you are. Now to my word. Uh, I, do, do we follow her or? Oh, we probably should. <laughs> the Windsor Bell hath struck eight. The minute draws on. Who comes here? Alas, what noise? Fairies, black, grey, green and white. Your moonshine revellers in shades of night. Your orphan heirs of fixed destiny. Attend your office and your quality. Elves, mission names. Silent toys. Cricket! 
<laughs> to wind the chimney, shalt thou leap, though fires of Feinstein raked in halves and sweat? The prince the maids of Spilsbury, a radiant queen, hates. There are fairies. He that speaks to them shall die. A wink and coach. No man their works must die. Go you, and find those who are asleep, and think not on their sin. Pinch them, arms, legs, backs, shoulders, sides and shins. About, about, search when the castle elves within and out. To just bear but till tis one o'clock, I will cast them down to round about the oak. Hear and hunt, let's not forget. Twenty glowworms shall our lanterns be, to guide our measure round about the tree. But stay, I smell a man of middle earth. Heaven defends me from that Welsh fairy, lest he transform me to a piece of cheese. <laughs> corrupt, corrupt, untainted in desire. I bet him fairy sing a scornful line as he trips or pinch him to your time. Pinch him fairies mutually, pinch him for his villainy. Pinch him and burn him and turn him about to candles and silence and push him out. I do begin to perceive that I have been made an ass. She returns this ring to you, sir. I left no ring with her. What means this lady? Fortune forbid my outsides have not charmed her. She made good view of me, indeed so much that sure me thought her eyes had lost her tongue. For she did speak in start, distractedly. <laughs> she loves you, sure. The cunning of her passion invites me in this churlish messenger. None of my lord's ring. Why? He sent her none. I am the man, if it be so, as tis. Poor lady. She were better of a dream. Disguise. I see. The heart of wickedness, what in the pregnant enemy does much. How easy is it for the proper false and women's waxen hearts to set their forms? Alas, our frailty is the <laughs> cause, <laughs> not we. For such as we're made of, such we be. How will this fudge? My master loves her dearly, and I, poor monster, fond as much on him, and she, mistaken, seems to dote on me. What will become of this? As I am man, my state is desperate for my master's love. As I am woman, now alas the day, what thriftless sighs shall poor Olivia breathe? O oh, time, thou must untangle this. Not I, it is too hard a knot for me to untie. Knockety knockety, who's there? We're trying to play snap. I can hear you, but I won't. Knock knock, never quiet. What are you? Who's there? Another devil's name. But this place is too cold for hell. I'll devil porter it no further. I thought I would attend to all professions in to see the mistress. Anon, anon, I pray you. Remember the porter. Was it so late here you went to bed, that you do lie so late? Is thy mistress stirring? Your knocking has awakened her. Doctor, follow me. Good day. How came she by that light? Why, well, I stood by her. She has light by her continually. Tis her command. You see, her eyes are open. Aye, but their sense is shut. What is it she does now? Look how she rubs her hands. It's an accustomed action with her to seem this washing her hands. I've known her continuing this a quarter of an hour. And yet here's a spot. Hark, she speaks. I'll note down what comes from her to satisfy my remembrance more strongly. Out, damn spot, out I say, one, two, why then times to do it? Hell is murky. Fie, my lord, fie. 
And who would have thought the old man to have so much blood in him? Do you mark that? The saying of Fife had a wife. Where is she now? What will these hands ne'er be clean? No more o' that, my lord, no more o' that. You mar all with the starting. Go to, go to. You have known what you should not. She has spoke what she should not. I'm sure of that. Heaven knows what she has known. Here's the smell of blood still. All the perfumes of Arabia will not sweeten this little hand. Ah! What a sigh is there. The heart is sorely charged. I would not have such a heart in my bosom. For the dignity of my whole body. Pray God it be, sir. This disease is beyond my practice, yet I have known those who have walked in their sleep, who have died wholly in their beds. Wash your hands, put on your nightgown, look not so pale. I tell you yet again, Banquo is buried. He cannot come out on his grave. I think we best leave. To bed, to bed, to bed. There's knocking at the gate. Come, come, come. Give me your hand. What's done cannot be undone. To bed, to bed, to bed.